Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for the, what is it, 14th, for the 14th. So this is a daily tarot reading for somebody, I don't know who, may or may not be you. We need one of these for an overall energy, and then we're going to use this deck right here. I keep looking at my hands because I just put lotion all over them, so anyway. What do we got for the 14th? The universe. 21. Completion. The end. New beginning. Major completion, right? I mean, that's what that is. Somebody has learned a lesson of some sort. They've successfully learned a lesson. Somebody has successfully learned a life lesson. <laughs> Maybe about strength. It may be about strength. I don't know. I don't know. They're both reversed. So maybe maybe it's about the 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 ability to let go. To let go of things that steal your energy, that, you know, aren't healthy for you. You know, maybe that's the lesson here. Anyway, this is a major completion, you know. And it does have to do with letting go. For sure. Nine of Wands with strength reversed. It has to do with holding on to things that don't serve you. I mean, the strength card reverse. That's lack of discipline. No willpower. Pride may have been in the way of something. Huh. These are like weakness. Hmm. Ooh. Ooh. Moving quickly in a new direction. Oh, yes. We have somebody here that is moving very fast, very quick. I mean, like, zoom, I'm out of here. I'm not holding on to this. I'm not. Somebody is letting go of something that has been unhealthy and that has held them back. Somebody is absolutely positively letting go because they're moving forward like I am gone. They recognize. Somebody is recognizing, you know. the progress that they have made and they're they're recognizing this as being a lesson, right? They're recognizing their ability to move on. They're finding their confidence to move on after not, you know, being confident, after being weak and being held back by something that was stealing their energy. Some it's like somebody has re regained their energy. They've regained their confidence and their self esteem and it's like they've been recognized or they're, they're, they're recognizing, you know, their ability to move on. So I feel like some, and this could be self-love. This is love. This could be also a new opportunity, a new opportunity for love that has come into somebody's life that has really opened their eyes. You see the eye? Love will certainly open your eyes now, won't it? So I feel like we definitely have somebody that is seeing love, right? This is a new love, okay? So I feel like somebody hasn't had the courage and the confidence and the willpower to let go of something, but now they've got this new either it's self-love, 
or they've discovered love. You know, they've discovered love within themselves, self-love, or they've discovered a new love. So, you know. This is could be a completion of a cycle, right? There's a completion of this, 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 uh, lack. It's over. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna let this steal my happiness. I'm not gonna let this steal my, my, my victory and success in life. I can't, I can't be held back. I see like somebody has made a decision. They've, it's like, it's time for me to complete this cycle. I'm letting go because I've discovered love, whether it's self-love or whatever, and I'm moving in a new direction now, you know? Somebody may be urging this person to do it. They may be saying, go, 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 you know, you know? So, so this person may be deciding to communicate or to just move in a new direction. This could be communication or a message coming in. Somebody may be receiving a message from somebody that didn't have the courage or the confidence or whatever to offer them love. Now they're deciding, you know, so maybe somebody has, said, you know, somebody's giving them the go ahead to do it. I don't know. Like, go, 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 go. Whew. Yep, somebody is taking action. Okay, this is where we've been. Somebody's been stuck. Somebody hasn't been, been using their power wisely. Somebody may have been lying to themselves, right? Somebody was stuck on an old idea or an old way, you know, and where things were, you know. They were letting their past wounds, their past cuts hold them back, per perhaps. I'm not sure, but somebody's been being dishonest with themselves, I think, closed off. Maybe there, you know, there hasn't been any communication or there's been a lack of communication because somebody, you know, couldn't let go of a past situation or who knows for what reason. But I see the action is being taken. There is going to be movement. There's going to be movement because somebody sees the love. Somebody sees love. It's like, I know, I know that this is love, whatever it is. Um, three of Wands reversed. Dashed expectations here. Ah. Nine of Pentacles reversed. Three of Cups. And at the bottom of the deck, we have Temperance. Okay, this is a card of purpose, a card of possibility, and a card of, you know, compromising, coming together. Divine timing. So I feel like somebody is probably... deciding that they don't want to be alone by the looks of things somebody doesn't want to be alone or somebody may be deciding could go either way somebody may be deciding i'd be better off on my own because there's no abundance here you know but I really feel like somebody may feel like they have wasted their time. You know, they've wasted their time uh, focusing on the past. And it's like it's time to move forward. Maybe they felt like, you know, they weren't enough or who knows what. But now we have somebody that is taking action because it feels like I don't want to be alone. Or Yeah, that's what I see. I want happiness. I want happiness. I really feel like we have somebody here that is going to be sending a message that's going to make another person really, really, really happy. And I think it's divine timing at work here. This is divine timing. I think there's probably been somebody who has lost their patience, perhaps. Somebody may have lost their patience, whatever. But I feel like we have somebody that is coming. I think they're going to come. It's going to happen pretty quickly going to happen pretty quickly and I think it's going to be unexpected unexpected I think that you probably don't expect it I don't I think that you probably don't expect it coming but I feel like this person is gonna is gonna is gonna come in um whoever this person is huh. there's movement happening put it that way somebody is making a move <clears throat> and it's like there's no time to waste you know, it's like there's no time to waste. Maybe that's what they think. There's no time to waste. There's been a delay. There has been a delay. And I think that now somebody's like, 
The King of Pentacles. <laughs> you know, I feel like we have somebody here that is mm, taking the lead, perhaps. He's been working on his stability and his security, and he's a very wise individual. He thinks and he plans and he makes sure that he has everything in order before he communicates. He makes sure that, you know, everything is taken care of so he doesn't make any wrong turns. I mean, this guy wants to make sure he gets it right the first time. So I feel like we have a person here that is, is going to, you know, definitely make some sort of move. The Ace of Pentacles. So, I mean, somebody's coming in with a new oppor a new opportunity. You know, you know, that's what we got here. Something big. Somebody is coming in with a new opportunity. That they're they're going to come with something. It's like they're going. Somebody is getting a new offer or a new or a gift. They may be. They may actually be giving them something. You know what I mean? I'm not sure what it is. It could be anything. Something you can touch. This could be a new partner. Okay, but this is wonderful. This is somebody is like manifested something big. Now this is secure, solid, stable. So I think that we have somebody here that is going to offer something secure, solid, and stable. It's going to make another person really happy. And I think this person has probably been growing lonely and thinking, you know, it's never going to come. It's, you know... But the reason it wasn't coming was because things were out of whack. Things weren't balanced, you know. This person didn't have anything to give. They had to recover. They had to recover themselves. And that's why they were reluctant. They were reluctant to move on. So I feel it, or to move in that direction, but I think, I think that they're moving now. Things, this is lack of balance, lack of harmony. There's been some drama. There's been some, there could have been some financial loss or there were some legal issues that somebody was dealing with that was hindering them from moving forward. But I feel as though, <clears throat> I see movement. I see movement. I do. I got I can't believe this shit. Six six six. Okay? Six six six. So this is somebody could be dealing with a Capricorn or a, a Taurus or a Virgo, but Capricorn is pretty prominent here. Um we have uh Aries, Leo, Sagittarius as well. We have Gemini, but I feel as though this is a perfect opportunity. I mean this is the lovers, this is a perfect match. Somebody it's a soulmate connection perhaps and it feels like somebody sees it. Some you see where I put the card, somebody is seeing the love in a soulmate connection, you know, they're seeing the compatibility. They're seeing the beauty of it all. And it's like now they're ready. I mean, they're ready to take that journey. They've learned some sort of lesson or they've completed a significant chapter in their life. They've allowed the completion. They've stepped over the finish line. They're ready to begin again. They're ready to, you know, I see love. You know, they see love. And it's like they're going to, they're taking action. I see love. I see love. I know that's a one, but I see love. I can't make this shit up, okay? That looks like a one, but it could be an I. I, I see love, or I see love here. Either way, this is love. I don't care what anybody says. That card says, I see love. So, we got some love here, and somebody is seeing it, and they're going after it. So, I don't know who this reading is for, but good luck. There's communication. They're going to, they're, it's like they're coming. There was a delay for some reason. It had to do with probably maybe some legal issues or some mental conflict or both. But they see the love connection. So. I don't know who this reading is for. I think it's going to be quite a surprise. 
when this arrives, I think it'll be very, very surprising because the person doesn't expect it. But the person, this person is so practical and responsible. This person wants to make sure that they, that they have all their ducks in a row when they come with their offer because it's going to be the offer of a lifetime. So, I don't know who this reading is for. I hope it's for you. Um, hmm. Somebody's moving towards a soulmate connection. Okay? That's what I see. If you haven't met this person yet, you can meet this person out, like partying, you know, at a party, socializing. If you haven't met this person, you could meet them out at a party, you know, with you're out with your girls, you're out with your boys, your friends or whatever. You could meet this person and you see this 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 golden nugget, <laughs> you know, this whatever it is. You see this like woo! Whoever this person is, this person is um They'll catch your eye, put it that way. This person will definitely catch your eye. All right. Um, it's just so it's such a it's just an opportunity that is undeniable, okay? This person may not may not um be what you're used to, but the connection will be like instant. An instant connection. I see love. I don't know who this is for, but somebody is is definitely heading in the direction after a delay. There's been a delay. There's been a lack of communication because somebody was really struggling with I mean, maybe even their health. Maybe several things, okay? We have health issues here. We have money issues here. We have mental conflict here. You know, you got to get right before you can move forward. So I feel like we have somebody here that has, you know, the temperance is about healing. The time is now. I'm, I'm healed. I'm ready. I'm ready. So I feel like we have somebody here that is ready and they're they're taking action. They are absolutely taking action. Okay? And they're they're making they're coming. They're coming with something. I don't know who this is for. I hope it's for you. Good luck. <laughs> 